welcome to Noosa! We are on holiday and we've been here for two nights. We just whizzed up for three days for a warmer holiday after the cold winter in Australia. We're on the Sunshine Coast, so it's further north from both Melbourne and Sydney. So it's warmer and I used to always come here every year when I was a teenager my mum would drive my sister and I up and this would be our family holiday here. So it's very familiar and easy and it's just a beautiful spot. So today I went for a walk up to the National Park. The water is so beautiful and blue. And yeah, this is one of my favorite places to come to. So I'm just in some walking gear. And yeah, we're gonna walk into the National Park. James is still asleep in bed. Um, so yeah, while James is sleeping, I'm going for a walk. I think mum's gonna call. Mum and my stepdad are looking after Bowser. And I've heard he's been a little bit cheeky, running away when it's walk time, because he thinks it's a game. Oh dear. Well, there's some surfers. Just out here, there's some little surf waves. Maybe not even big enough right now to catch one. I'm not wearing my bathers, but I did pack my bathers and they're still wet from yesterday, so I'd have to do a bit of a Mr. Bean trick, putting it all on under a towel. Or I guess I could just go to the public toilets here. Maybe that's a better option. <laughs> but I have a theory that Tea Tree Bay, the tea tree leaves, they're really good for my skin. I swear my skin always feels amazing after swimming there. Oh, it's so pretty. And yeah, we've just been going out for beautiful meals, coffee, taking it really easy, sleeping in, having nice dinners. I've been enjoying dressing up for dinner. And James and I went shopping yesterday. And you guys can probably barely, barely hear me with all the waves right now, but I'm at Tea Tree Bay. It's beautiful. This is what it looks like. There's some um, surfers out there. And there's lots of people doing the National Park walk as well. And it is just absolutely stunning. I just love it here. I wanted to go for a swim, but I'm not sure that I will. There can be a bit of an undercurrent here that can be quite strong some days, which I wouldn't go out very far and feel safe. But ever since I've uh, had my chronic pain and was sick, I just don't have the same amount of confidence. Like, I'm just a little bit more timid about doing things that usually I would just go and do. So, this is an example of me just feeling like a little apprehensive and being like oh I mean I could but I just I think I'll just go back to the main beach just gotta build up my confidence again and strength again and that's just I think it's just gonna take a little bit of time There's lots of historic signs you can read here. I'll be honest, I haven't read them yet. And I've got to rush off to um, go meet James for breakfast. It is Sunday. I really want to read these, so I'll hopefully read them tomorrow if I have time. But I do like reading the signs. They're very interesting and I love the design of these. We had a beautiful breakfast, pancakes for Sun Dog, because it is Sun Dog today, aka Sunday, but we say it's for the dogs. And now we've just had a little bit of a rest. As you can see, it's, it's not sleepy time. And this is where we're staying. Um, it's very nice. I'll give you guys a grand tour. And then we're going to go for a little shop. So I've taken out my suitcase right here 
um, because there wasn't actually that much room in the bedroom, so ignore our mess. But this is like the lounge, kitchen. Up there, there's twin beds, which we're sleeping in. Just kidding. Nice kitchenette. Lovely TV area. Some good paintings as well. Whoa. These stairs are very squeaky. So you might be able to see how low this ceiling is, which is very sweet. So there's one bed here, one bed here. But yeah, it's just a very cute mezzanine level. Quite nice lighting up here, actually. You can see James all the way down there. This would be fun for kids, I think. Very dangerous yeah, actually, it is a bit dangerous for kids. You wouldn't want to have too many cocktails. You'd hit your head up here and fall down these. It's kind of like halfway between a ladder and steps. Don't worry, guys. I'm being very careful. My dad taught me to always have three limbs connected. One arm, two legs. Well, apart from stepping. You need to stop <laughs> All right, follow me through here. Da, 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 da. And here's the bathroom. It's got all of my makeup everywhere. But yeah, nice bathroom, shower, toilet. It's funny because we have this kind of mirror in both Sydney and Melbourne and also these panel details. I guess it's the coastal vibe that we like. And this is the main bedroom in here. Guess which side I'm sleeping on. Oh, my um, switch probably gave it away. But my side's the side with the blankets on it because I get cold and James gets really warm. Um, and then we can look out onto Hastings Street, which is like the main strip. But the most beautiful part of this is, of course, the fact that it goes right out pretty much onto the beach. But we do have some trees in front of the beach too. But you can see the beach peeking through the trees there. And I've never actually stayed on the beach anywhere before, so this feels very fancy and then that's that's what it looks like and then the pool's down here haven't been in the pool i rather go swimming at the beach beautiful blue skies and then there's been weddings on the beachfront here and here um birthdays except for sunday so maybe they don't hold them on Sundays. So yeah, we're probably gonna go for a little shop. Um, I wanted to see if there's anything for my mom and stepdad to say thank you for looking after Bowser. We'll see what we can find. I need another coffee to be honest. And then, coffee. yay! James needs one, I think. What are you talking about? I'm fine. <laughs> and uh, then tonight we'll have the final supper, the Aww. final dinner. That's really sad. Why do you say it like that? Because it's sad. The final supper. It's sad. And then um, I'd like to go for a swim today as well. infused with, with lavender. Yeah, lavender and you had fresh almond milk. Fresh almond milk. This is like cool. deli in a cup.
Ah, uh, it's turned off now. It's not. I can... No, it's turned off. The red light means it's off. Oh, really? Yeah. The number counting up and the red light means it's off. And it's not recording. Sure. It's fine. I can see it's fine. <laughs> I'm just having a little bit of a pool session before we go out for dinner tonight. Although it's about two o'clock and the UV is still pretty high. So I'm just drying off in the sun from the pool and then I'll go to the shady chair to be out of the sun. And then when the UV goes down at about 2.33, then I think I'll go to the beach and just lay in the sun fully. because we like to do early dinners and then when we get back we're like oh god it's bedtime at eight o'clock <laughs> then we usually watch stuff together so we love an early booking and also it's before it gets too busy it's easier to get bookings if it's a place that gets you know booked out and I'm really happy with my eye makeup tonight I've been trying to get a little bit better with the eyeshadow so I like that um not the best lighting though. You can kind of see it here. There we go. There we go. A little close up. There we go. There we go. There he is. <laughs> and I will show you guys the outfit. I'm wearing this denim dress. Damn girl. Wow, well, thank you. It's quite short. Whoa. It's quite nice to wear something other than black, I will say. Oh. <laughs> it is dinner time. Thank you for pressing the thing or else we wouldn't be able to open the gate. I thank you, James. Welcome. Um, yes, we're off for a lovely dinner. This is where they have lots of weddings along the front. You can actually see all the rose petals down there. Oh my gosh, the beach looks amazing. What would it look like from your perspective? Ah, if we were guests. No, if you're married. Ah. Oh. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Ah. Look at that perfect pinky sunset and beautiful colours, soft. And you know you can never photograph sunsets on camera, so that's pretty gorgeous. Hmm. Oh, there's a really cool tree up here yeah. too. Check out this really cool tree. And I just think it's really cool with all the roots hanging down. Careful. Yeah, don't do that. Don't break the tree, James.